Heart attacks are one of the world's most serious health emergencies, affecting millions of people every year. Knowing the early warning signs can mean the difference between life and death. In this video, we will explain what a heart attack is, reveal the seven early signs everyone should recognize, and discuss what to do if you or someone you know experiences these symptoms. We will also touch on prevention and modern treatment options, all illustrated with clear 3D animation for the entire family. A heart attack, or myocardial infarction, happens when blood flow to a part of the heart muscle is suddenly blocked. This blockage is usually caused by a blood clot that forms in a coronary artery which supplies blood to the heart. Without oxygen-rich blood, heart muscle cells begin to die within minutes. The faster a heart attack is recognized and treated, the better the chances of survival and recovery. The first early sign is chest pain or discomfort. This is the most common warning sign. It may feel like pressure, squeezing, fullness, or pain in the center or left side of the chest. The sensation can last for more than a few minutes, or it may come and go. Some people describe it as a burning or tightness similar to indigestion. It is important to remember that not all heart attacks cause severe pain. Some people experience only mild discomfort or pressure. The second sign is pain or discomfort in other areas of the upper body. This can include one or both arms, the back, neck, jaw, or stomach. The pain might start in the chest and spread outward, or it may appear in these other areas without any chest discomfort at all. Women are more likely than men to experience pain in the back or jaw as a primary symptom. The third warning sign is shortness of breath. This can occur with or without chest discomfort and may happen before or during a heart attack. You may feel out of breath while resting or during light physical activity. Shortness of breath occurs because the heart is not pumping blood efficiently, causing fluid to build up in the lungs. The fourth sign is cold sweats, nausea, or lightheadedness. Breaking out in a cold sweat for no clear reason, feeling nauseated or experiencing vomiting can all be signs of a heart attack. Lightheadedness or dizziness may also occur, and in some cases, people faint. These symptoms are more common in women, older adults, and people with diabetes. The fifth early sign is unusual fatigue. This is more common in women and can develop days or even weeks before a heart attack. The fatigue is often extreme and not relieved by rest. You might feel exhausted after simple activities or even while doing nothing at all. The sixth warning sign is heart palpitations or an irregular heartbeat. You might notice that your heart is beating faster than usual, fluttering, or skipping beats. While irregular heartbeats can be caused by many things, when combined with other symptoms, they may signal an impending heart attack. The seventh sign is swelling in the legs, ankles, or feet. When the heart is not pumping effectively, fluid can build up in the lower parts of the body. You might notice swelling, tightness in your shoes, or indentations in your skin after removing socks. Recognizing these early warning signs is critical, but it is also important to remember that symptoms can vary. Some people, especially women, the elderly, and those with diabetes, may have milder or more unusual symptoms. For example, they may not have chest pain at all, but instead feel tired, short of breath, or have pain in the back or jaw. If you or someone around you experiences any combination of these signs, especially if they last more than a few minutes, seek medical help immediately. Call emergency services right away. Do not attempt to drive yourself to the hospital unless there is no other option. Emergency responders can start treatment on the way to the hospital, which can save precious time. While waiting for help, if the person is conscious and not allergic to aspirin, have them chew and swallow one regular strength aspirin. This can help slow the formation of blood clots. Help the person sit down and rest and loosen any tight clothing. If the person becomes unconscious and is not breathing, begin CPR if you are trained to do so. 
Modern treatments for heart attacks are highly effective, especially when started quickly. Doctors may use medications to dissolve blood clots, procedures like angioplasty to open blocked arteries, or surgery to restore blood flow to the heart. The goal is always to limit the damage to the heart muscle and prevent further complications. Prevention is just as important as treatment. Major risk factors for heart attacks include high blood pressure, high cholesterol, smoking, diabetes, obesity, lack of physical activity, unhealthy diet, excessive alcohol use, stress, and a family history of heart disease. While you cannot change your age or family history, you can control many other risk factors by making healthy lifestyle choices. Regular exercise, eating a heart-healthy diet rich in fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, not smoking, limiting alcohol, managing stress, and keeping medical conditions like high blood pressure and diabetes under control can all reduce your risk. Regular checkups with your healthcare provider can also help detect problems early. In summary, heart attacks are leading cause of death worldwide, but many lives can be saved by recognizing the early warning signs and acting quickly. Remember the seven signs, chest pain or discomfort, pain in other areas, shortness of breath, cold sweats or nausea, unusual fatigue, heart palpitations or an irregular heartbeat, and swelling in the lower body. If you notice these symptoms, do not wait get medical help right away. Protect your heart, protect your life, and share this knowledge with your loved ones. Subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and hit like. Medical Vision 3D is dedicated to exploring the science of the human body in 3D. All content is for educational purposes only. If you notice any symptoms or have health concerns, please seek medical advice from a doctor immediately.